is up guys Phoenix here and welcome back to another pixel art tutorial part for Sobble from our Pokemon Gen 8 uh, sword and shield <laughs> pixel art tutorials so I think this is part three and what we did is the entire frame last time so we're going to finish up the eyes and the cheeks and some of the just the facial stuff I think we'll have time to start the fin as well but um, we'll probably do a four-parter because I am feeling low energy. So I'm going to just do maybe 15-minute increments. We're just going to chop this one out and then keep it moving. So where we last left off, I think we laid four flat right here with some uh, dirt blocks placed on it. And this is right by the circle or oval shape we created in the middle of his face. So locate the four flat that we marked with the dirt. And we're going to continue from there going up and to the right. So that would mean we're going to continue with... Our placement blocks going to the top or right side. So we're going to start off by going up and to the right. Four singles with our coal. So one, two, three, and four. And let's just delete the dirt blocks behind that. From there, we're going to go up and to the right. Two vertical, two times in a row. One, two. One, two. Up and to the right, three vertical. One, two, three. Up and to the right, six vertical. Place the block on top or right side. One, two, three, four, five, six. And as you can see, we're getting another oval shape for the eyeball. And there's going to be basically three circles within each other. There's going to be the white eyeball, the blue, and then there's going to be another inner pupil, I think it's called, for the white again. So anyways, from this six vertical, we're going to go up and to the right, eight vertical now. So place the block on top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And from this eight, we're going to go to the top block. And I want you to count three down. One, two, three. And from that third block, we're going to add two pieces of coal to the right. One, two. We'll be coming back to this two flat later, but we're going to finish up this eyeball first. So we're going to continue at the top of the eight vertical and go up and to the left, three vertical. One, two, three. Up and to the left, four vertical. One, two, three, four. Up and to the left one single. Up and to the left two flat two times in a row. One, two. One, two. And from this two flat at the top, we're going to start lowering it back down. So I want you to go underneath the final block each time with our placement blocks. And it should make it a lot easier for this transition. So from here, we're going to go down into the left two flat two times in a row. One, two. That's one. Put your placement block. One, two. That's two. Now from there, we're going to go down to the left two singles. So placement block one, placement block two. And as you can see from the right-hand camera screen, it's starting to kind of curve out, which is good. We just need it to be an eyeball shape. We don't need it to be too, uh, too fancy. It just needs to be a circle or oval. Anyways, from those two singles, now we're going to go down to the left two vertical. Placement block underneath. One, two. Down to the left one single. And then down to the left two vertical again. One, two. And if you zoom out, you can see the shape we have going down right here. We started with the flats, and then we converted over to singles and then verticals. So we have the two singles, two vertical, one single, two vertical. <laughs> now to finish up this shape, all we're going to do, and hopefully finish up, because we needed to connect it to the diagonal to make sure we did everything right, is we're going to go down into left four vertical two times in a row. So place the block underneath. One, two, three, four. That's one. And we'll do it again. One, two, three, four. Four, that's two and then to close this shape out we're gonna go down into the left seven vertical and see if it touches at the diagonal so put your placement block underneath or to the left side and let's go down one two three four five six seven and it did touch at the diagonal which means we did the shape correctly <laughs> now within this circle we have two more circles to do for each layer of the eyeball before we can move over and start covering uh, the two flat over there and working with the rest of the face so what we're going to do is to the seven vertical we just created to connect everything back up. So this one right here. I want you to find the top block in the seven vertical. And add two pieces of placement block to the right, not coal. After those two pieces of placement block, we're going to add a coal to the third space. So this one right here. So as you can see, we have two blank spaces, then a coal. So from that floating coal now, what you're going what bleh, what you're going to want to do is you're going to put two blocks on top, one two, 
and five underneath. One, two, three, four, five. Sorry if I can't count so well. Anyway, so it should be eight in total. Make sure you count it up if you need to, if you're a little bit unsure. And we're gonna be working with the top part of it now. So we're gonna be going up and to the right. Three vertical. One, two, three. Up and to the right, two vertical. Placement block to the right. One, two. Up and to the right, three single. So placement one, two, three. And then to reach the top of this oval shape, we're gonna go up and to the right, three flat before we get ready to bring it back down. One, two, three. From here now, we are going back down. So the placement block is underneath, as you can see. So we're gonna be going down into the right one single and just keep putting your placement block at the ending. It just keeps everything going smooth, makes the transition very easy. Down into the right two vertical, one, two. Down into the right 11 vertical, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 11. And from there, we're gonna be going to the, down into the left and then up into the left. So I suggest switching over to putting your placement blocks to the left side, just so that way when we're going back up, you can still keep your placement blocks on the left side and you should be just fine. So we're gonna be going down into the left from here, three vertical, one, two, three, and then placement block on the left. Down to the left, two vertical. Actually, hmm. I wanted to sharpen out first. We're gonna go down to the left one single, then two vertical. One, two. So let me just see what you did there. You, we did 11 vertical, then three, then one, then two. Now put your placement block to the left of the final block so we can go down to the left one single, and then down to the left four flat. One, two, three, four. <clears throat> From this low four flat, we're gonna be going back up and trying to connect to the eight vertical we originally had over there. So we're gonna be going up and to the left, two vertical, then three vertical. So let's see if we can do that. First, one, two, placement block on the left, and then we're gonna go up and to the left three vertical, one, two, three. And as you can see, it met at the diagonal, which means we've done this shape correctly as well. So that's two of the three circles done. We need to do the most innermost circle, which will be colored in with white. So what we're gonna do there, sorry for the background noise. Um, what we're gonna do there is where we have this middle block, this eight vertical on the left side. I want you to find the top block in it and add two placement blocks to the right. One, two. From those two placement blocks to the right, kind of like what we did before, we're gonna add one coal to the right except this time from that one coal, and I'm deleting these dirts, um, from that one coal, we're gonna just add five to the bottom of it. One, two, three, four, five. So it should be six in total. Once you have that, we're gonna find our way to the top of the block and put our placement block there. So we can go up and to the right two vertical. One, two. Up and to the right two flat. One, two. And then since it's a lot smaller now, we're gonna have to bring it right back down. We're gonna be going down to the right, eight vertical from here. Placement block underneath or to the right side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. Now to lock this shape out, all we're going to do is go down to left one single, down to left two flat, one, two, and from the left block into two flat, so this one right here, we're just gonna add one coal to the top and that should lock out the shape. And there we have the left eye. So if you're wondering the colors, it's gonna be white, cyan, white, or I guess like a dark blue. We're gonna go over the colors later, so don't worry about it right now. Or you can see it in the thumbnail, but um, I'm a bit unsure on the colors because it's a lot of blue. Anyways, going over to the right side of the eye now where we had the two flat marked with coal, we can start going up into the right from there and we're eventually gonna be going down into the right. So I suggest putting your grass block to the right of your final block every time and you should be just fine. From the two flat, we're gonna go up and to the right one single. We're then gonna go up and to the right two flat again. So place some block to the right or top side. One, two. We're gonna follow that up by going up and to the right four singles now. So one, two, three, four. Make sure you count that carefully. We're just building a bridge between his eyes. And from here, we're going to put a place block on top and go up and to the right 
two vertical, one single, two vertical, one single. So it's a two, one, two, one pattern, all right? So let's start two vertical, then one single, just like that. And we're gonna do that same thing again. And this is all at the diagonal. So put your placing block, two vertical, one single. Very easy. Nothing complex. And then on that final single, we're gonna follow that up by placing one extra block to the right and working with that. From that extra block to the right, we're gonna put one on top, one below, and we're gonna use that below piece to start bridging towards the second eyeball now so that we can shape it out. So let's put our placement blocks to the right side each time so that way it's a lot easier to work with. And we're gonna go down into the right, three vertical, one, two, three. Down into the right, one single, down into the right, two vertical, one, two. Down into the right, three singles now. One, two, whoops, two, three. Down into the right, two flat. One, two. Down into the right, one single. And we're getting ready for the curvature to start. So let me just kind of zoom out and recap. So you can see we're slanting out right now. We have a lot of verticals, then the singles, and then that transition uh, that transitioned us over to the flats. So we have three vertical, three vertical, one single, two vertical, three singles, two flat, one single, and then we're gonna do two flats three times in a row. All right, so placing block to the right side, and then we're gonna place two blocks, one, two, just like that. And we need to do that three times. So this is the first time, so let's place some block up again. One, two, that's two, and one, two, that's three. And from the final set of two flat, we're gonna add an extra block to the right to work with that, kind of like what we did at the top of the arch over there. Now from this extra block to the right, what we're going to do is we're gonna put two below it and three above. So one, two on the bottom and go all the way up to the top and then one, two, three. And let's work with the bottom of this so that way we can connect everything up before finishing the rest of the eyeball. So we're gonna be going down and to the right of this. So just keep putting your placement block to the bottom, you should be fine. Uh, we're gonna go down and to the right, four vertical to start. One, two, three, four, placement block. Then we're gonna switch directions and go down and to the left, four vertical. One, two, three, four, placement block. Switch directions a third time, and we're gonna go down and to the right, four vertical. One, two, three, four. You might think I'm joking, I'm dead serious. <laughs> We just switch directions like four times. Anyways, from there, we're gonna go down and to the right, two vertical, two times in a row. So place some block underneath. We're gonna do one, two, that's one. One, two, that's two. We're then gonna go down and to the right, three singles. One, two, three. Down and to the right, two flat, two times in a row. One, two, that's one. One, two, that's two. Down into the right four flat. One, two, three, four. And from that four flat, we're gonna add an extra fifth block to the right side, like right here, as you can see. And all we're going to do from that is add five below it and one on top. One, two, three, four, five. And then the one on top. Let me just make sure everything's correct there. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, okay. So it should be seven in length. Now we're not going to touch this one on top yet, but I'll mark it. But with the below blocks, we're gonna go underneath it and add an extra placement block underneath so that we can go down into the right, two flat. One, two. Down into the right, six flat. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then from there, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up into the right, three singles. One, two, three. And as you can see, we're building the cheek, the little pouch cheek thingy that's on the left side. We need one for the right side. So that's where we're building. It's right, it's directly connected to the right eyeball. But before we continue with these three singles, I want you to go to the middle block right here and go down into the right four singles with the coal. One, two, three, four. So it should touch down on the right side of his face. 
and that's just separating some of the darker blues from the cyan and we'll see later when we get to the coloring why that's important but for now we're going to go back up to the three singles and go to the top one and go up into the right three vertical from it placement block one two three up into the right four vertical one two three four and from there we're going to go back in so that we can finish up the eyeball so we're going to start going to the left side let's go up into left two vertical one two and then up into left five flat one two three four five it's looking good now if we want when we have the six vertical over here we put one block on the top right there and we didn't continue with it we can now continue with it and we're gonna go to the right of it and put one block like so from that one block to the right we are then gonna go up into the right four singles one two three four and you can see we're really really close to connecting with that pouch piece over there all we're going to do is go up into the right three vertical so placing block to the right or top side one two three as you can see that three vertical touches directly to what we had before at the first block now let's finish curving out the eyeball so we're going to keep putting our placing blocks on the top side for this next part so let's go up into the right four vertical one two three four up into the right 10 vertical one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and then we're going to switch direction we're going to go to the left side now and go up into the left four vertical one two three four up into the left three vertical two vertical then one single so we started with four we're gonna go three two one so keep going to the left side we're gonna go three vertical first one two three then two, one, two, and then one, one. Easy pattern to complete, and we're already almost ready to flatten out and bring it back down. So from that one single, we're gonna go up into the left two vertical again, one, two, up into left one single, up into left two flat, one, two. As you can see, I'm just putting the placement blocks at the end each time. I'm not really speaking right now because we're still just placing them on top. But now from here, we're gonna go up into the left one single again. And then we're gonna finish off this top piece by going up into the left five flat. One, two, three, four, five. Since this is the top piece, like I said, we'll be going back down with it now. So our placement block will be on the bottom or left side. So let's go down into the left two flat. One, two. Down into the left three single. One, two three and then we're gonna go down into left two vertical three times in a row so place the block underneath or to the left side and we're gonna go one two like that that's one let's do it again one two that's two and then finally one two that's three it's perfect for the eyeball but we still have two more circles to do for the inner eyeball kind of like we did over there so let's get that over with so first off, what we're going to do is where we see the bridge connect to the right eye, you see how we have the two flat going into this six vertical right here. I want you to follow it all the way to the bottom of the six vertical. So this bottom block right here. And what we're gonna do is on the bottom block, we're gonna add a placement block to the right and then a coal, like so. And then I want you to add two placement blocks after that and then another coal. So your build should look like this right now. You can now delete all the co um, the dirt blocks and keep the coals there. These are the two segments that are gonna start each of the final loops. So for the first one, we're gonna start on the left one. We're going to add four to the top of it. One, two, three, four. We're then gonna go up and to the right, two vertical. One, two, put your placement block up and to the right, two singles one two placement block then we're going to round out the top right here very early by going up into the right three flat one two three and then we're going to start bringing it back down from there we're going to pick up the kind of the same shape as we had on the left side we're going to go down into the right two singles one two down into the right three vertical one whoops one two three down into the right two vertical, 
one, two. Down to the right, 12 vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. And let's go back and delete these dirt blocks now. And now this is the farthest point to the right, so we're gonna be going to the left now. So put your placement blocks still underneath or to the left side and you should be fine. So let's go down into left two vertical. One, two. Down to left two singles. One, two. Down to left three flat. One, two, three. And from the three flat, we're gonna go to the final block right here. And we're gonna go up into left the three singles. One, two three now to hopefully get this to connect back up all we're going to do is with these next two segments we're gonna go up into left two then five so put your placement block on top for each segment we're gonna go up into left two vertical first one two then placement block and then we're hoping to connect at the diagonal right here by going up into left five vertical one two three four five and it did so that's perfect it's very good we only have this final loop to go and then we're done with this part of the tutorial. So with this one single we have floating here already, we're going to add two to the top of it. One, two. And then from the top block, we're gonna add two to the right of it. So it creates this weird arrow shape, I guess, and it's um, connected directly. It's not at a diagonal. Sorry for the stutter there. Anyways, from this arrow shape, we're gonna go all the way to this top right block and we're gonna put a placement block underneath or to the right side so that we can go down into the right two vertical then put a placement block again down to right seven vertical one two three four five six seven down at the left one single down at the left two flat one two and then we're going to start curving it back up so we're going to go up into left three vertical one two three and then finally, we're gonna connect this, hopefully at the diagonal, by going up and to the left, five vertical. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect, so that finishes the eyeball segments for this part of the build. Um, I kinda wanted to do the entire mouth, but my voice is hurting right now, so hopefully I'll get more done in the next part. But we're gonna be having to do the mouth, the fin on his head, the tail, the arms. Jeez, we have a lot to do. Um, probably should get it done in this part, but I, I really don't have the time. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more pixel art content. This is Phoenix, and as always, I will see you guys later. Bye.